Alright guys, welcome back to a, yet another video, um, I got in permission to do this video from a hospital called China's Hospital, um, first, guys, I'm gonna read off what I have here, and then, I will go on from there. Um, it says, My name is Nathan Retro. I was born with club feet from two days. I was cast at age four. My parents was told my feet was going to be fused. That's when they found China's Hospital for Children. Over the years, I've gone through 20 surgeries to help me walk, run, and play ball and get around as well I do, as well as I do. Through the years, China's has been there to help me and my family. I would recommend Shriners Hospital to anyone who has kids born with club feet, lost limbs, or problems. Check them out or call the or, or call or call one eight zero one five three six three five zero zero. That number right there is China's Hospital for Children. Or check them out. <laughs> China's Hospital for Children helps kids with club feet and kids that can barely walk. And many other things. There is a doctor named Kristen Kill. She helped me out so I can walk and she will also help those in need. Dr. Kristen Kill is the Chief of Staff at Shriners Hospital for Children. I was born club feet and they took care of me from the age of five when we found them till I was 18. The hospital is kind of like St. Jude's in many cases you don't see a bill. I made many friends up there at Shriners Hospital for Children and the food is yummy. They are done 20 surgeries and if it wasn't for them I would, wouldn't be walking. Just wanted to put a shout out for them and they are a great place to go. I would recommend I would recommend them guys. Um they uh they helped me out so many ways in one they also If it wasn't for them guys, all my viewers out there, all my friends, if it wasn't for Shriners Hospital, I would be in a wheelchair today. I wouldn't be walking, I wouldn't be running. And I would
would be a, in a wheelchair for the rest of my life if it wasn't for Shinus Hospital. And I do have pictures to show this picture right here is of the front of the Shriners Hospital and then here's one where I was born and then here's another one and in this one you can see my feet are frontwards But in this first picture, my feet was like this. My feet was like this, guys. I could not be walking. And I'm glad that my feet are like this now. Because of Shriners Hospital. In this next pitch in this next picture they are casted I also got a teddy bear in this third picture and then in this fourth in this fourth picture here I have green cast on and the fifth I got blue cast on and then in this one, I started to walk. And then, from when I started to walk, I started to get around a lot easier. And then, this one, I'm playing ball. If it wasn't for Shriners Hospital, I wouldn't be doing this one. And then, there's a picture of me in a wheelchair because I had surgery when I was up there on my on my left foot and next to me is a dog and these dogs right here guys are specialized to come in and uh, help patients like me that I was up there and here's a statue in front of China's hospital this picture right here is the entrance is the front desk you sign in here and then they send you either back in the back here or upstairs. Here's the gym where you can play basketball or bring your, your lunch. And then this doctor right here. Her name is Dr. Kristen Kill. I mentioned I mentioned it in the, the article. She uh, is one of the amazing doctors ever. If it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be walking. And this is one of her assistants. And this picture is Dr. Kill and the rest of the staff. Me and uh, Dr. Kill and the rest of the staff are very good friends and we made very, uh, very good memories up there. And right here is the kitchen it's the cafeteria staff um they uh, they do all the cooking they cook breakfast they cook lunch 
Und ja, ich hab Glück, Jena. And right here is where Dr. Carroll is operating on a patient. She fits in the nub and the patient's laying right here on the table. And then here's a picture of Dr. Carroll. When it was my last, my last surgery up there, and I got to see her, and here's me, right here, in the room, and this was my last surgery, if it wasn't for if it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be standing. And guys, that would that's it for this video. Um, guys, I would recommend China's Hospital for children to anybody. I would. I I recommend it. And guys, please remember to subscribe, turn on notifications, and leave a like. And I will see you all in the next video.